Hey, Math 31, I had a question coming out of section 6.3, number 61. And the question here is, is there such a number that ln of x is equal to 2? Well, let's, let's answer that question. Can ln of x be equal to 2? Well, keep in mind, anytime you see this natural logarithmic term, that's asking you to do a log base e. And I know e sounds like a variable, but keep in mind, e is about 2.7128, and it keeps repeating. It's one of those constants in math, like pi, right? We're always really solid with pi, 3.1415. Ooh, technically these should be approximates. But we tend to forget about e. So e is a number here. All right, and so if I want to solve for this argument, I would like to solve for x. Well, when I have a logarithmic equation and I want to solve for the argument, I'm going to rewrite this as an exponential equation. So if I want to rewrite as an exponential equation, that means there are basically three circles I have to fill in, one, two, and three. So let me change pen colors, and then I'll, I'll clean this up once we're done with it. But we always know the base of our logarithm is the same as the base of our power. And I've also said that the logarithm itself is an exponent. So this 2 would get translated here. And then that leaves the argument to go here. So if I rewrite that, I'm looking at x is equal to e squared. And, and there it is. I have solved for x. So what is that number that will let ln of x be equal to 2? Well, if x is e squared, we're looking at it. So let's go ahead. I'm going to block this off. Let's check our work. So let's see what ln of x is equal to if, in fact, x is equal to e squared. So this would be ln of e squared. So this would be log base e of e squared. And we've talked about when the base of your logarithm and the base of your power are the same, the only thing that survives is this exponent. Because quite literally, how do I get from e to e squared using nothing but exponents? Well, I need an exponent of 2. So this whole thing simplifies to 2. And so I've verified it. All right. And that's how you do number 61. All right. Thanks so much. Bye.